So today I'm gonna to take you through a follow along legs and ab workout. Now this is how I structure my week. On Monday I do legs and abs. So the workout today we have four circuits. We do three rounds per circuit. I'm gonna take you through step by step the first round. I'm then gonna pause the screen. I'll put the workout on the screen. I want you to do the next two rounds by yourself and I'll join you for the next round. Super easy, follow along. We're gonna get started straight away. Now let's just warm up our legs a little bit. So down on the ground, I just want you to stretch out those hip flexors. Side to side, obviously take your time. I'm gonna rush you through this warm up just to show you what to do. You can absolutely pause the screen, do your own warm up. If you've warmed up already, great. Go for a walk, whatever you need. I'm gonna place the equipment that you need on the screen right now. So go grab that equipment if you don't already. I will provide you with substitutes as well through this workout so everyone will be able to do it together. All right, another quick stretch. I call these school stretches nice and fast. You know, at the end of your PE sessions, you do your quick school stretches and then you go back to class. All right, so I'm gonna call that the warm up. I really hope that you take some time to warm up your body properly. We're gonna get straight into the workout and I'm gonna take you through the first round, okay? Each exercise is 30 seconds and we are starting in three, two, one with a squat thruster. So down and we're pushing up on the way up. So squat down, keeping that weight on your shoulders, sit back and push up. 30 seconds. From here, we're gonna move into skipping. If you don't have a skipping rope, you can just do a crisscross on the spot. Good, keep it going, keep breathing, nice big push. Moving into skipping in five, four, three, two, one, and pick up your skipping rope and we are skipping for 30 seconds. Again, if you don't have a skipping rope, you can just crisscross on the spot. Skipping is great. It's a great way to get your heart rate up. Nice high intensity exercise. Good one to put in between your exercises as well, even if you're in the gym. Swapping over in five, four, three, two, one, and we are moving into a curtsy lunge from here. So rather than a normal lunge, you're stepping behind, you're actually stepping behind and around, keeping that front knee straight. Alternate side to side. Really feel that glute. From here we're gonna, whoa, almost lost balance. From here we're gonna move into an X mountain climber. In five, four, three, two, one, and we are down on the ground. Normal mountain climber is straight X, is opposite knee to elbow. Good. And you can hear how puffed out I am. That's from not warming up properly. Make sure you warm up and cool down before all your workouts and after all your workouts. Swapping in three, two, one, and rest. Okay, so the exercises are on the screen. I'm still here. I know you think I'm gone, but I'm still here. I'm watching you. You've got another two rounds and I will meet you for the next circuit. Let's go.
right, so we're here, circuit two. Let's go down the ground, reverse tabletop. Starting in three, two, one. And the best way to do this is to get into that tabletop position first and come backwards. Good, coming up that glute bridge and come back. Good, 30 seconds. Let's go. We're moving into ab bike straight after this. Up and squeeze those glutes. Burns my triceps every time. I'm not even bending my triceps. Five, four, three, two, one. Down the ground, straight into ab bikes. Good, getting that opposite elbow to knee. Now this is an identical copy to the workout that is in the sweat app. So if you like this workout, go check out the sweat app. You're gonna love all the workouts, all written by me, all the workouts that I do. This is how I love to train. Let's go. From here, we're moving into an X plank. So high plank position in five, four, three, two, one, and moving into a high plank position. And we're gonna to touch our opposite hand to foot. You're probably wondering what these dumbbells are doing here. Special exercise where you need my favorite exercise. Can't leave, you're already here, guys. You have to stay with me. Good, keep going. Opposite hand to foot. We are moving into <laughs> burpees in five, four, three, two, one. If burpees weren't bad enough, we are going to add a weight. So jumping back, jumping in, coming up, pressing over your head and coming back down. 30 seconds. Let's make burpees a little bit harder, shall we? I think I prefer this. I don't have to do the jump up at the top. So I don't mind adding in that weight. Good, almost there. Five, four, last one, three, two, one, and break for 10 seconds. You have two more rounds. I'll be back for circuit three. Let's go.
circuit three. Now we don't need any of the equipment for this circuit. We are starting with a pop, squat, and twist. In three, two, one, and we're gonna twist, pop, squat, twist. Another great one to get your heart rate up. From here, we're gonna move into a half burpee and plank jack. I used to love doing those on my boot camp tours. It looked so good as the whole crowd did the... It was part of the warm up as well, how mean. Let's go. Swapping in, five, four, three, two, one, down on the ground. And we are going in, out, out, in. 30 seconds. Now, if you find this hard, you can walk it in, walk it out, step out and step in. Up to you. From here, we're gonna move into a lateral lunge. Swapping in. Five, four, three, two, one, and up. In the middle of your mat, we're going to do a lateral lunge, side to side. 30 seconds. And my hair needs to be reset. There we go. Side to side. From here, we're going to move into a glute bridge walkout. Sit back, really feel it in your glute. Five seconds, four, three, two, one, and down the ground into a glute bridge. Set yourself up first and into that glute bridge, and then you're gonna walk your legs out, out, in, in, but you're alternating your legs, which one you're bringing out. Keep those glutes on. If you need to stay here for a second and make sure that's up nice and tight, do that and then continue on with the motion. And resting in five, four, three, two, one. 10 second rest, two more rounds. You got this. Let's go. I'll see you for round four.
four. If you are still with me, congratulations. Last circuit, let's go down the ground. We are doing plank dips to start. This is gonna be the easy exercise out of the entire circuit, starting in three, two, one, and let's go side to side, keeping those hips nice and high, like you're drawing a big C. 30 seconds per exercise. From there, we're moving into a straight leg deadlift. So we're up, we're gonna grab those weights, moving into a straight leg deadlift. Focus on those obliques. Swapping over in five, four, three, two, one, and we are up, safely picking up our weight. Coming up, legs nice and straight, pushing our hips back and coming back up. Really, this just feels like a really great stretch for my hamstrings, which is super tight at the moment. Keeping those weights nice and close to your body. From here, we're moving into a straight leg raise and a hip lift. Five, four, three, two, one, and the weights are down. Hands underneath our bottoms and we're lifting our legs up. Good, pushing all the way up. Can you hear my back sweat sticking to the mat? That's attractive. Five, four, three, two, one. Moving straight into one and a half burpees. You're going in and in again. Jump up, down, in, in again, and up. If a burpee wasn't hard enough, we've added weight. <laughs> And now we've added another jump. Let's go. In, in and up. In five, four, three, two, one. Not finishing that last one. Two more rounds and then you are done.
do. Congratulations. If you like workouts like these, I'm going to place the sweat out link below. This workout is from sweat, identical workout. This is the workout that I do on Mondays. Incredible work, guys. I'll see you next time for our next workout. What should it be? Arms and abs, maybe.